told the guys like, you know, you make it this far and, and, and you're 31 and 0 going into the last one, the last 40 minutes of the season, there's absolutely nothing you should ever feel bad about. And they'll look back on this season as time passes as, uh, as something just, uh, amazing and, uh, incredible. But it, again, just hats off to Baylor. They, they dominated us on both sides of the ball. All right, thank you, Coach. We'll now go to questions. Michael DeCourcy. Mark, you've now had to uh, address a uh, losing locker room twice in a national championship game. Was it any different being that you had not lost prior to tonight? I mean, it's obviously a feeling these guys had never had to uh, address and, 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 and deal with, but I think the nature of it tonight probably made it uh, you know, I mean, it's not, it's not easy, but again, I just, you just, as a coach, try to give them as much perspective as you can. And, and as is usually the case with everything, time will, time will lend them the, the best perspective, but, uh, uh, Hey, they, they've just been an amazing, unbelievable group. And I just told them they're just so easy to coach and so easy to travel with and so easy to deal with all this, you know, COVID stuff that we dealt with all year. Uh, um, uh, you know, the, 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 I, I just was amazed at how they handled everything. Danny Thompson. <clears throat> Coach Hugh, Danny Thompson with a three-point conversion. Congratulations on a great season. As you look back on, I know the season just ended, but what did you learn about yourself and the group of players that you coached in arguably one of the most difficult circumstances dealing with COVID throughout the entire season? I mean, just a great question. What, what I learned was just the, my guys are of the highest character and they just love this game and, and loved each other and loved this team enough that no matter all these crazy protocols that were put on them and not playing in front of fans and testing every day and having to quarantine for 14 days because they might or might not have been close to somebody for over 15 minutes. And, and, uh, none of them would take the love for basketball, uh, that they have away. And also the, the desire and love that they had to, you know, to hoop together and to play together. So their resiliency and their drive and stick to itiveness and just, and their positive attitude and enthusiasm was just something I'll, I'll take, I'll take with me the rest of my life. Brenna Green. Coach Fio, Brenna Green, from Two Sports. Um, Jalen Suggs was uh, obviously broken up and emotional um, after this one. Um, you know, obviously a lot of one and done guys are looking towards the future. Just what do you think it says about him, uh, how incredibly emotional he was? Uh, I mean, he's a winner. He's a winner, and he lost for the first time in college basketball. So, uh you know, he's, he's highly competitive and he doesn't like losing. And, uh, you know, I think in, in his mind, he, he saw us cutting down the nets at the end of this, but, uh, you know, I mean, he's, he's also young and as time goes by, he'll, he'll gain better perspective on, on what an incredible impact he, he had on this team and, and heck on college basketball. And, uh, uh, you know, we were, it was a blessing to be able to coach him. And he, and I thanked him for just how coachable and what a great teammate he was and, uh, and just what a winner he was. Jim Meehan. Mark Few reflecting on the season that was and what could have been. And Gonzaga, just the latest team to enter the Final Four undefeated following Indiana State, UNLV, and Kentucky as they come up short going 31 and 1 still a heck of a season for the Zags getting the national championship but they come up short here in Indianapolis want a sports network that delivers everything that matters about the game the highlights the picks the instant analysis no yelling no fake debates no politics hit the subscribe button and never miss a moment